A 45-year tradition for the West Texas Rehab Center continues this week with the annual summer day camp. Close to 100 campers from the age of 3 up to 12 are all having fun with a variety of activities. Aaron Hunter has more in tonight's News Connection. This week, over 90 campers and their buddies get to load up on buses and head out to a ranch for a three-day summer camp just southwest of San Angelo near Twin Buttes. I think it's a great opportunity, and these kids are always dying to come back year after year because it's something so much fun. We have the ponies out here. We have the swimming. We have the water activities. The camp is specially designed for the kiddos who go to occupational, physical, or speech therapy at the rehab center. All of our kids, like I said, are patients, so they have a specific diagnosis that, that you know, brings them to West Texas Rehab. But out here, their diagnosis does not define them. They just are out here to have a good time and play and swim and do all the things that any kid should get to do at camp. We spoke to volunteer and president of ASU Ram Air, Hallie, who says the experience is full circle. I think it's great. I used to go to West Texas Rehab when I was younger, um, and I remember coming to these camps, and I just remember it was so much fun, and we were, I really enjoyed it, and I think it's a great way for these kids to go out and have some fun during summer, and it's like a camp made for them. She spent the morning sharing her love for planes as she helped children create ones. We're making paper airplanes with all of our West Texas Rehab campers and buddies. Um, we have some pre-made airplanes for the kids who maybe can't make the airplanes with their motor skills. And we also have like a runway and a target for them to aim at. Multiple activity stations wouldn't be available without the community's help. Staff say it would simply be impossible. We have food um, all three days that are donated by local restaurants. Um, we have, like I said, we have activities and volunteers that donate their time, and we wouldn't be able to do this without them. San Angelo's Barnhart family started the camp 44 years ago, and today campers continue to enjoy their time in the sun. For News Connection, I'm Erin Hunter.